Thank you, Ryan. Trails are closed for deer hunting in Minnesota. So we've got some other updates about some outdoor news. All that and more as we take you around the Northland trail by trail. We start across Minnesota where, like I mentioned, many trails have closed ahead of deer hunting season. The use of off-highway vehicles is restricted in areas where hunters can use a rifle. This applies to state forest trails and access routes, but not to forest roads. Deer hunters may use OHVs if they're out hunting. That applies to before shooting time from 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. and after legal shooting hours. So while trails are closed, let's take a look at some other outdoor notices. The Shawamigan Nicolay National Forest began reducing water levels at Johnson Springs this week, lowering the levels in preparation to remove the dam on Long Lake Branch of the White River near Drummond. Leaders say this project aims to restore upstream habitat and overall fish habitats. The drawdown is intended to be gradual enough not to harm any shorelines. Dam removal is scheduled for the middle of next summer. And we wrap up in the Keweenaw Peninsula of Michigan where they're talking about snow. Visit Keweenaw is inviting everyone to participate in a snow guessing contest. How much snow will Michigan's North Peninsula see? A winner will receive bragging rights and some swag from Visit Keweenaw. This is the snowiest part of Michigan and leaders say they are ready to rebound after last year's unusually dry winter. We'll have a link to the contest on our website. And if you or someone you know is part of a local trail club or alliance, send us a report once those trails reopen and it might be featured as we take you around the Northland trail by trail.